Hello and welcome to the TU Sports Desk pregame report. I'm Adam Miller alongside Donovan Hugel. And Donovan, we have a fun yeah. one today. Yeah. It's a rivalry game. Jeff Collins is back at the link playing his former team, the Temple Owls. And it's going to be a good one. It's going to be fun. We yeah. know what both teams are going to do. What do you think about this game? Do you think there's maybe is a little bad blood here? Yeah, there's definitely some bad blood, Adam. You know, at, uh, at Temple football's practices on uh, Tuesday, you could tell that the players, you know, they marked this game on their calendars. Chappelle Russell and Sean Bradley, they were talking about it a lot. And, you know, I think they're really excited to get after it today. What are your thoughts about facing uh, Jeff Collins? I'm, I'm, I'm extremely excited. Uh, this is one of the games I have marked on my calendar for a long, long time. You know, your, your former coach left after, you know, he told us he was never leaving. So it's like, eh, hey, we, we get to see you again now. But, you know, it's all love, no, no hate at all, no bad feelings. But we just got to come out there and worry about us. I think that, um, you know, it'll be cool to be on the same field as those guys again. But, you know, we have our coaching staff here and we love them and we don't want to play for anybody else. So. We're happy with what we have. And yeah, it's a redemption game, too. It's not just a bad blood game because both teams are now coming off of tough losses. Temple against Buffalo, Georgia Tech against Citadel. And the thing is, we know what both of these teams need to do to win the game. For the Yellow Jackets, it's running the ball. They don't have a great quarterback. Lucas Johnson's only passed the ball for, guess what, 136 yards so far this season, one touchdown. You know what they're going to do. And for Temple, it's the other way around. Yeah, for Temple, they want to pass the ball. Russo is going to look to Brandon Mack and Isaiah Wright a lot today. He's thrown for 944 yards and 10 touchdowns so far this season. Uh, but he can't do what he did last week where he threw three interceptions against Buffalo where they lost. Absolutely. Through the first few games of the year, he's completed over 60% of his passes. Fast forward to last week, only 49% of his passes, three interceptions compared to two in the first two games. The game starts at 3.30 at the link. Be sure to get your popcorn because it's about to be a movie. For, Temp for Donovan Hugel, I'm Adam Miller signing off for Temple Update.